We are helping you send the kids to back to school in style because today we're sharing some current fashion trends for tweens and teens so that you can make the most of your shopping budget. Studio 5 style and fashion contributor Casey Matheny is here to fill us in. Great to see you. You too. Um, this back to school business is expensive. <laughs> yes, it is. It can cost a mama. Uh-huh. Especially when you've got multiples, which yeah. you and I both do. And there's some strategies you say will help you make the most of the budget before we even get into trends. Yeah. Absolutely. There are some tips that I recommend following because this can be emotional and it can be expensive. So hopefully these can help you a little bit. And there's a lot of opinions on the table. This yeah. is the first year of opinions in our house. Third grade brings opinions. Yep. There's what I want her to wear. There's what she wants to wear. Yep. So help us. You're, you're, you're part psychologist, part stylist, part mom today. Mom. A, a lot mom. First yes. you say take a good inventory. Yes. So first of all, we want to make sure what is even in the closets. What are we dealing with? And what what do we have, right? Get the kids involved. Absolutely get the kids involved. I feel like if they are involved in any part of their existence, mm -hmm. everything goes smoother, True. right? Because they have a say. So get those kids involved. You want us to make a list of needs and wants. Yes, that's another big thing is I think it can be a big expense at, at first. But if you're like, hold on, hold on. What are the needs? And yes. then from there, figure out what the wants are. But tackle those needs first. And here is a brilliant piece of advice that I think is underplayed and underpracticed. It's actually something my mom did with us growing up. But all the shopping doesn't have to happen right now. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I keep trying to tell Harper, my yes. little girl, who we're going to see later. Yay. But she wants to buy everything now. And I'm like, honey, you're wearing the same the, the same clothes on the first week of school as you've worn all summer. Yeah. So let's buy maybe two outfits that are fun and exciting and then save the rest for when like the temperatures actually dip. Exactly. Utah classrooms are hot. Not yes. all classrooms have AC even. So yeah. we've got to kind of be smart in how we yeah. play it. Yep. And you say this is where the therapist comes into play, the financial advisor too. You're a lot of things today <laughs> for us. But set the budget in advance. Yes. Make sure that there is a budget because those little pieces add up a lot. But if you have a number in mind, that's even a fallback to help them, right? To be like, yes. well, does that fit in your budget? Yes. Not my bu budget, but your budget, does yes. that fit? So it kind of holds them accountable. Life lessons. All right. Yeah. You're sharing a few styles that are really hot right now. Yeah. And these are styles we want to emphasize you can pair with what's already in your closet. So yes. we're stretching. Yes. We're stretching. Always. Um, you brought some helpers, as you mentioned. Do we get to see Harper? Yes, Harper. Your mini me. I don't like that phrase, but it totally applies. Come on, Harper girl. I'm so happy she's <laughs> here. Dude. Okay. This is my Harper Lou. And um, she is just dressed head to toe in a, in, in a couple trends. She looks fabulous. She does. Okay, let's first cover crochet. Okay. We have seen crochet everywhere from swimsuits to dresses, bags, bucket hats, all of it. Yeah. Tops is a big place where we're going to be seeing crochet. And this is something that is really fun that they can express their personality in with color and pattern. Um, as it gets cooler, you can also layer over it or under it. Right. But we're going to be seeing this a lot. So cute. Cargo jeans are in for the teens and tweens this year. Cargo everything. Who would have thought? Shorts, jeans, um, parachute pants. They are everywhere. And the good thing about them being everywhere is you can find them at all price points. Good. They're at Walmart, Zara, North. Nordstrom, Target, you name it. I think these specific ones are Zara. Um, but you're also going to find that you can elevate them, right? Like she's really wearing a really pretty blouse. They yes. don't have to be dressed down casually. Yeah, but t-shirt works too. And totally. shoes, I've told you this, shoes is where I really struggle. Okay. So Oxford, you're pointing us to the Oxford look. Yes, because I think an easy place for kids to go are tennis shoes. We're going to see them all over the place. Mm -hmm. The second place that's been very, or the second shoe that's been very popular are Oxfords. Mm -hmm. And they are fun. They're elevated. You can wear the little frilly socks with them. You can also just wear them sockless. Yeah. And I mean, you look so cute. You ready for it? Yes. Is this what grade? Fifth? Sixth. Sixth grade. Sixth grade. Harper, we're cheering you on. You look like a million. Thanks so much. We love you. We love your mom. We'll trade you out with Mr. Cole. Nice. All right. See what trends are we seeing here on this handsome guy? Okay. So with gentlemen, I was going to say boys, but you know, you're, you're in between. He's taller than you. He so is I taller yeah. than okay. me. I can't call you a boy. <laughs> we are seeing this casual um, aesthetic. 
and it's a little more elevated than basketball shorts in a tee. There's purpose to it. Okay. So starting with your top, we have lots of oversized tops. Mm -hmm. um, it's not that we bought an extra large. We bought his size. They're just oversized. I think and that's, that's good for moms to know. Like, be prepared. It's not a slouch. It's not yes. a grunge. It's just the style. This is just yeah. the style to have it a little more oversized. Okay. To balance that, you're going to look for a more fitted pant or shorts. Are those fleece? Yes, these are fleece lined, also a little more elevated than just a basketball short. Right, but still comfy, right, Cole? Yeah. yeah. Right, we want we want these gentlemen to feel comfy and confident yeah. and have that casual look, but also just like feel put together. Yeah, you look great. Uh, shoes. Kicks. I mean, we're going to see all sorts of kicks from Nikes to Adidas and Converse. Um, I love these. The crew socks are still very much okay, in. Okay, I was going to ask about the socks. Yep, That's a yep, thing. Yep, okay. very intentionally done. But, you know, he. how, how do you feel, Cole? I feel very comfy. Yeah, oh, comfy, good. cool. You look great. You Cole, look thank great. you so much. Thank you. We'll swap you out next. Helping us out, Livia. She's 14, and she's showing a really cute trend, the varsity yes. jacket. Hi, sister. You look so cute. Isn't this fun? Like, this preppy I love it. look is so in. I actually have last summer or last year it started to come in and I told Harper, I said, you need to get a varsity jacket. And yeah. she said, I won't do it. <laughs> and then this year, guess what she was asking for? The varsity jacket. The varsity jacket. So these also, this is from H&M. You can find them at all price points and they are just a fun throwback, right? 90s is everything. This mm -hmm. varsity letterman jacket is very throwback, mm -hmm. but kids are wearing it as the current hot trend these Denim days. Denim shorts, good basic. Denim shorts. And then the crop tanks are just everywhere great to layer over yeah but just a really solid piece to have in a closet i will say check your school dress code just in case right <laughs> oh for sure just I in mean, case absolutely don't want anyone disappointed it's so cute it's so cute on you and then the high tops the, emmy was asking for the high tops this year high tops are are in i mean these blazers are amazing and they're great for them to run around in but yeah. you know they're current too you're looking cool you feeling ready yeah big back to school what grade Eighth. Eighth grade. Oh, All right. Knock them dead. Thanks so much, Livia. We appreciate it. So we've hit on some standout trends, a few kind of micro trends that you're pointing moms and even grandmas to if they want to do a little back to school giftable. Oh, for sure. Okay. What do we got? So one is just stacking up your wrist with bracelets. And I think thanks to the Taylor Swift summer, these homemade kind of friendship bracelets are very much a thing Cute. and all of these we we made we bought off amazon and made and we've been busy all summer making them super cute what else um um just fun accessories so these earrings are from a local company called pit pop post they're adorable they have the cutest funnest designs but flip them around these are all flat back screw on no pokey no pokey Look sleeping them playing them um, hip pop hip pop post cutest name isn't that cute claws are still claws in. still in and another shoe which i wanted to share are the clogs i think for we kids. need those yes yes comfortable still runnable and i talked to talk to my children and they're like crocs are not as much in. Uh -huh. Instead, let's look for like the Birkenstock clogs. I'm Still an easy those. slip on. Yes. You don't need to lace them, but just casual. And, and look polished enough. Yep. All of the checks yep. all of the boxes, as we say. Casey, yeah. thank you so much. You're helping our teens feel confident and mom feel confident too, as you're helping those teens get ready for the big back to school. Where can we get more advice from you? Yeah, Casey Matheny Style on Instagram. I live there, love it, have fun there. Or my website at CaseyMatheny.com. I sincerely get excited every time you post because she's yeah. teaching us as she's yeah. sharing, and I value that. So thank you so much.